today we got some more Pokemon ranked battle. But first, I just wanted to, I, fi I figured out how to show you guys my team, my rental team. You guys can see, now see the code. I am recording, right? Yes, I am. So you guys can now see the code. So you guys can try this team out for yourself if you'd like. And maybe you could try it out and help me out with my weaknesses. Right now, I know that one of my big weaknesses is my lack of grass support because my Wizardicot is the only thing that has a grass move. And my Wizardicot dies pretty quick usually, especially with uh, oh, so many T-Tars going around with uh, Sandstream ruining my Focus Sash. But nonetheless, we're going to skip ahead to the video now. We found ourselves a game. And it looks like, so he's got the Lucario beat up. And he has the Draco Vish. And he has the Grimmsnarl Prankster. So what we're going to do is we're going to lead Grimmsnarl for sure. So that Thunder Wave could come in clutch. But what beats the Lucario fake out? Or the Lucario beat up Rotom he does. For sure. Does Rotom actually have that low of HP only 125? Is there something wrong with my Rotom? I think I did everything right. Whatever. Then we're going to bring Gastrodon, of course, for that Dracovish. And then we're going to bring... Dragapult is looking kind of noish. Or Corviknight. What beats my Corviknight here? The RK9 does... And that's it. We're going to bring the Arcana, our Corviknight. I'm not scared of that Arcanine. Arcanine. Whatever you want to call it. I ain't scared. Can you guys hear my computer just like begging me for mercy right now? It's just like, please don't stop recording. I can't handle this anymore. And I'm just like, too bad. Hey, Lucario once forgot. So the beat up strat. So, of course, we're going to Thunder Wave the Wizbacop. And then we are going to... Ooh, what do we want to do here? Because I kind of just want to overheat, but I also kind of want to Dynamax so I don't lose my special attack. We're just going to regular overheat on this Lucario. Yeah, I think that's the play. I don't want to use my Dynamax this early. Especially because I know he's going to use his Dynamax now. You know, if he goes with the classic strat with uh, Winsmacott and Lucario. Which I'm sure he is. I'm pretty low rank. So this is just kind of what people do down here. They just go for the basic stuff. You know, the beat up Lucario shenanigans. And then what is Max? Does Max Knuckle? Max Knuckle is probably going to kill Grim Smile. Right. Because Grim Snarl... Sets up a lot of stuff for me. So let's see what he does. But my Rotom should go first. I have Choice Scarf. So that's Prankster Thunderwave. That's why that goes first. And now you're not even going to get your beat up off. Which would be lit. Overheat goes before the... Oh! Oh, it lived. It lived. Alright, so regardless, even if he doesn't get paralyzed, he didn't get the, the Justified because I made his Wizard go last. With that paralyze. So that's good. And he's paralyzed, can't move. Lol, dude. So now, of course, we're gonna do. See, here's the thing. Oh, I don't know if my Grimstar like goes first. Like, I could just go for the play ref on the Lucario and hope that I outspeed him, but I don't know stats. And a pro would know that. So I'm just gonna reflect to play it safe. Because I don't know stats. He's going to probably max guard Lucario here. But that'd be kind of weird if he did that. It's like it'd be super pointless. Oh, okay. Tailwind. There you go. So now, now he goes first. Dang it, dude. He's, he's going to kill my Rotom Heat right here, isn't he? Oh, man. I wish that Whisper would have got paralyzed. That would have been so clutch. Yes, he does go first. Reflect. Please let me live. No. It doesn't let me live. That Tailwind, dude. I cannot believe that Tailwind got up. Oh, yikes. Dude, I should have just Dynamaxed my Rotom. Do I have anything that's going to go first? No. I'm totally not going first. Oh, boy. That was my chance. Oh, this hurts. 
I'm just gonna go and let's Corviknight here. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna play ah oh, dude. We're gonna Thunder Wave the Lucario. Here we go. This is the strap. Thunder Wave Lucario. And then we're gonna Brave Bird. Or we're gonna max airstream the Lucario as well. So maybe I can go first, which I doubt, but at least even if I don't go first, I can live. Max, my max airstream will give me the plus speed boost that I need. So this isn't, this is my best case scenario. I really should have just Dynamax the Rotom Heat. So now I know that for next time though, just Dynamax the Rotom Heat, guarantee they go down. Okay, Thunder Wave hits, thankfully. So you should be going slow now. What does Makai use beat up? Wow, he's just going for it all. Like, he thinks he's living this round. I really hope that this paralyzes, like, really stops him. Like, I hope that, like, even if he does go first. Actually, I hope he goes first and the paralysis makes it so he's unable to move. Because then he'll totally rage quit. Or it would be really funny if this is accidentally killed somehow. Which I highly doubt it. Yeah. Max Steel Spike. Oh, he does go for it, but why is he going for a Steel Spike? Oh, to kill the Grim Snarl? That's fine. Not fine, but as long as my Corviknight lives, that's what I really wanted. It really sucks, actually, that... Oh, my goodness. This isn't working out for me at all. Thankfully, though, I'm going to get this Max Share Stream up. I have to go first next time. There's no way I don't go first. I now have plus speed, and you're paralyzed. Ooh, sorry, I just cracked my knuckle in the mic. Man, dude, that was rough. That was rough. I knew exactly what I was doing, and I still got outplayed. That's how I know I have so much to learn. Even though I knew exactly what he was doing, I still got outplayed. It's okay, though, because he's going to have Draco. <laughs> oh, my goodness, I'm so smart, dude. Nice Draco vision, dog. So we're gonna go ahead and we're see it. We're gonna ice beam the Wizard and Max Airstream it, so we can. Oh, do I want the speed boost or do I want the defense boost? I want the defense boost. For sure, I want the defense boost. So we're gonna steal Spike inside of Airstream. That way, I can definitely live this Draco. Oh wait a minute. Oh no, wait. Oh, wait, I'm good. Okay, I was, like, so concerned. I was like, wait a minute, he's going to outspeed me. But, duh, dude. I have water or storm drain, so he can't vicious run. So he'll still outspeed me, I'm sure. Yeah, he does outspeed me. He's probably choice banded in that. The second thing is break my screen? Oh. Any moon blast? Oh, that hurts a lot. You're going to live that gastro, right? Oh, my goodness. Boy, did this game, this game is looking rough for me. Okay. This game's looking real rough. I was kind of starting to wish I would have Max Airstream to help my Gastro go. Ah, he would not have went first anyway. Okay, still going to take out the Wismacop. Okay. So he's stuck into a Psychic thing now. And my Gastro lived, which is really nice. So now I don't think he's going to want to double up in any of my Mons here. Either one of them. RK9, of course. Well played. Intimidate hurts. I don't like the Intimidate. Oh, <laughs> my dude. I always forget about Corviknight and how gangster he is. So, are you both less attack now? Oh, my goodness. Oh, no, not both of you. Dang it. Why aren't both of you? This is your last turn of Tailwind. So, obviously, I got to go for the recover and just hope and dream. And then we're going to max Airstream. Just to hope and dream I can somehow outspeed you. Oh, this is... This is comes down to the... Ooh, that hurt. Please don't burn me, though. Okay, that's good that you have... So you're life orbed. Okay, so you are going to go for the gastro, which is fine. I mean, it does suck. But I just didn't want you to double up in the Corviknight slot. Like, I didn't want Corviknight to go down. Ah, oh, you big living that. So here, here's what we got here. We do have Roost. Oh, you have a berry? How much, is, how, what kind of berry you have? Uh, all right, we're good, we're good, we're good. 
Okay, so you know I'm gonna have a Tailwind, and I have Max Airstream. I'm gonna live a Psychic Fang for sure. This is looking good, because now, now I can just Brave Bird you, and the Arcanine will go down, and then I can Roost next round to the Draco. Actually, no, the Draco's Choice Scarf. He's probably still gonna go first, isn't he? And he's definitely Speed. Um, Eevee'd. Let's just see here. I honestly don't know. Like, I don't know what to expect you to go first here. I just really hope it's me. Because I did two max airstreams and you no longer have a tailwind. Dude, if I can go first, that's my only chance of winning this. Literally my only chance. Yes! Oh, thank you. Okay, I need the RK9 to go down. Thank you. Okay, I have a chance. I have a chance of winning this now. Because I can survive a Psychic Fang here. Barely. Perfect. Barely. Oh, I'm living. Oh, my goodness. I'm so good. Yes. Yes. Holy cow. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Holy cow. See, that Gastrodon came in so insanely clutch because he couldn't use Vicious Rend here. He had to use a different move because he couldn't. My Storm Drain. And uh, I'm just going to. So, I don't want to go for a Brave Bird yet, because it's going to make me hurt myself from Recoil plus Life Orb. So, I'm going to bulk up, and then I'm going to Roost again. Just so I can make sure I beat this thing. I don't care how long this takes. This is what I'm going to do to make sure I beat this guy. Plus, I get my defense. I'm going the safe route to make sure I beat this guy to one-on-one. -on -one. He's going to keep Psychic Fang. He's hoping for a crit here. I'm going to just bulk up again. I'm not even going to Roost yet. Because that other that bulk up added my defense so much. I'm just gonna keep bulking up until we, do I just keep bulking up until he quits? How long is this video? It's like just around 13 minutes long. Are you guys okay if I just keep it in bulk up until he quits? I'm not gonna do it now because now I'm in the yellow. I don't wanna get critted. No, I think we're gonna do it. Let's see what happens if I roost. I'm gonna roost. I'm gonna bulk up one more time just to see if he quits. Okay, and then I'll just do the brave bird. What does he do? He just keep going for it. He's not quitting. We're going to do one more bulk up. <laughs> this feels so good to finally win. You know what really suck? If he crits me and then my life orb and my recoil just knock me out and I lose. Ha, <laughs> there's the rage quit. All right. Finally. It feels good to win. I went on a pretty big losing streak uh, testing out this team. As you, like in the beginning where you've seen my... My Wismacot, I've been dealing with my Wismacot a lot, trying to figure out, like, what's best for the old Wismacot. Where? So, Lucario's speed is 142. And he's max speed, and nothing else is max. And then, oops. Draco Vicious speed is 127. I just need to learn these things. And then I also need to figure out what's going on with my Rotom Heat. Is my Rotom Heat actually that low? The Pokemon Showdown is down as the time I'm recording this video. That's going to do it for today's video guys thank you guys for stopping by i'm glad i got a win and because like i said i've done a lot of losing today I'm trying to figure out my wisdom cot what set i want to have on it because i had trick room on it and i took that off for u-turn because trick room only helped me out one time and it didn't help me out when it was supposed to and my head's supposed to help me out like 10 times so thank you guys for stopping by in the description below is links to everything twitter instagram that i'm trying to learn how to use which i don't really know how to use and all of running on empty stuff the running on MT apparel shop is also in the description below. We just added, we added a new hoodie design. We also added a long sleeve t-shirt. We added flannel shirts and then a bunch of other miscellaneous stuff such as book bags, scarves, and then they wanted to add an apron. I think that's kind of silly, but it's also kind of funny. So we're keeping the apron on there. If any of you, if one single person sends me a picture like on Twitter or Instagram or whatever a picture of them in a running on empty apron I'll do something special for you just one person I don't care who it is but if one person does it in a reasonable amount of time by the end of January 2020 because I know that if you order one it takes a while for it to get made I'll get you something special. I'll figure something out. Make something special. I'll do something for you. Thank you guys for stopping by. See you later.